Did you know that when Christ sacrificed himself on the cross, that he actually went into heaven and presented himself with his blood to God the Father once and for all? This is, uh, this is a fulfillment of the, 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 all the offerings that um, all the Old Testament priests, they, they will get to the, uh, the temple and to make the offerings um, yearly or monthly. And uh, that offerings is only merely a human temple, sanctuary, tabernacle, you know. And, and uh, they have to repeat that. But Christ, he went right into heaven. <laughs> you know why? Because he's also God. Just this is where he came from. So he knows the route how to get there. <laughs> he knows how to get there. Let me read that to you. Hebrews chapter 9. Very powerful scripture. Okay. Verse 24 onwards. For Christ did not enter a sanctuary made with human hands. That was only a copy of the true one. He entered heaven itself. Now to appear for us in God's presence. So he appeared for us. In God's presence. So he really bring his. You know. Uh, he entered the, the heaven. He entered heaven to appear before, bef before God for us, okay? Verse 23, Nor did he enter heaven to offer himself again and again, the way the high priest enters the most holy place every year with blood that is not his own. Otherwise, Christ would have had to suffer many times, but he has appeared once and for all at the culmination of the ages to do away with sin by the sacrifice of himself. One time, once and for all, you know, once and for all, his, he came to God the Father in heaven. All right, so Christ was sacrificed once to take away the sins of many. And he will appear the second time not to bear sin, to bring salvation to those who are waiting for him. Hallelujah. On his second coming, he's not going to bear any more sins. That's done. But he's coming the second time. To bring the actualized, the actual salvation, complete salvation to those who are waiting for him. Only those who are waiting for him remember that. And those who are not are doomed to eternal hellfire. But he's coming back. No more suffer again. He's done with suffering one time. Once and for all, for all humanity, of anyone who believes in him. Only the elect, not all of humanity, correction. Um, then, you know, the second time is going to come back to, to uh, consummate that salvation, to bring to all of us and bring us back to heaven for all eternity. Uh, I think the heaven could be on earth. Jerusalem, heaven in Jerusalem comes down on earth. So that is our hope and that is the rationale.